As we continue to celebrate Women's History Month, we're introducing you to a cycling group racing towards gender equality. And we sent Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo to go along for a ride with those ladies who call themselves Queens Rule Together. Call them road bike royalty. As a member of the cycling group QRT, or Queens Rule Together, Jenna Foley and her squad are riding towards a more inclusive bike community. Cycling can be a really individual sport, um, so it's really special that we have found a lot of community, a lot of support for one another. Its mission is to help women of color accelerate the learning process <laughs> and overcome the financial roadblocks when it comes to bicycles. We'll do free classes and clinics on how to change tires, basic bike maintenance, so you don't have to pay you know, to go learn that somewhere else. And I went along for a ride. What's been the most special thing about joining QRT? There were a lot of barriers for me when I entered this sport, and now I get to be a part of eliminating those for other women. Queens Rule Together is an offshoot of another cycling group called Kings Rule Together, a men's only cycling club. We were so intimidated until we finally had a Queens ride for all of the women. They started with just four queens getting together during the pandemic here in Philly. And it really just took off from there. Now, more than 200 ladies have joined, some forming their own chapters. So we have local members here in Philadelphia, Delaware, Charlotte, Northern Virginia. We have some in Virginia Beach. We have LA. And she adds their motto is strength in numbers, and she encourages anyone interested to apply. In Philadelphia, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.